Good afternoon, viewers, and welcome back to another episode of Careers Bistro. Well, as an Amobian son. So let's dive right into it. So in today's on today's fun page, we have in our HR column, we have Agnes. Agnes speaks about career success, about how career success posi positioning is vital, and she is right indeed. And then we head over to our profile, who is Miss Wendelin. Wendelin is a designer, an events designer. So if this is your forte, you should definitely grab yourself one of these today. And then we head over to page two. On page, on page two, on our local profile, we have a local profile by Philemon Nam Namupala. He is basically the founder of BAW. BAW is a brand created to enhance and protect cars. So basically what they do is they wrap cars. They can change the color of your car. So this is quite interesting. And if you are interested in this, stay tuned for the video of Philemon Namupala where he gives us a bit of an insight. My name is Philemon Namupala. I am 21 years of age. I am the co-founder and CEO of Baker Auto Reds. Uh, I started this business around about last year in November. Yeah, last year in November. I, opened, I officially opened the, the business this year, last month. Yeah, and I was inspired by this last year DJ, goes by the name of DJ Melody. Absolutely love this guy. And I got the idea of raping cars from him. And I brought the idea to Namibia. And hopefully it will go well. Okay, thank you. So now we're gonna dive right into our movers and shakers. So on this in this week's publication, we have Casey. Casey has been on air, on air talent for about 14 years. So Casey will be relaunching Fresh FM in the immediate future. Interesting. And then another mover and shaker we have here is Sylvia. Sylvia is a cleaner at the Namibian Breweries Limited and a subsidiary of ONL. This is where the brewery brews beer. But at the same time, Sylvia is also assures us that she makes the best lemonade in town. Interesting, isn't it? And then now, on page three, we have our long service award. So on page three, we have Captain Marky. He worked on sea for 42 years. What a long time. So he retires after many memorable years with, Dep with the Depp Marine family. Quite interesting. And then now we have our new appointment. Our new appointment is Memory Garises. She completed her undergrad studies at the University of Namibia in a Bachelor of Law. She was recently, or she was actually appointed as a legal officer in the Insurance and Medical Aid Division in 2018. And then on the 1st of June, she was appointed as a legal advisor in the Legal Service Division. Mm, you go, girl. And then on our page four, we have Fit Medics Wear, MFW. This is the all-female team of Fit Medics Wear who aims to create an environment where healthcare workers can fit, uh, can fight the pandemic in comfort and in style. And then we head over to page five. This is where our news is. And then on our page five, we have a story of where the S where the MSM is key to an inclusive and sustainable 
recovery. Basically, this is about the United Nations Assembly, where the United Nations Assembly in 2017 declared 27th of June as the micro, small, and medium-sized enterprises day, which is celebrated all around the world. And then right below that, we have a story that talks about, or a news story that talks about Lady Puhamba, where Lady Puhamba Clinic receives vaccination drive support. So in solidarity with Namibian government in fighting a pandemic, NetBank Namibia has donated 100,000 Namibian dollars to the vaccination clinic at Lady Puamba Private Hospital towards COVID-19 relief. And then we move over to page six. On page six, as we, on page six, our first story is about SME development. The local furniture retailer, Nictus, embarked on an empowerment program that supports small local entrepreneurs with capital to fund their manufacturing operations. Oh. And then right below that, we have Community Gardening Initiative. Well, the Community, govern govern the community Gardening Initiative, my bad. The city of Wintook has over, no, has taken over activities at Farm Okuna, Okukuna in Windhoek's Koreahap informal setup and in settlement. So that's quite interesting. And then on our page seven, we have key to the business ignition and robotics. So STEM is a center in Windhoek who gives learners the opportunity to learn about coding and robotics. I'm telling you the news here, quite interesting. And then lastly, we have Kwisip Munshek Fire Survivors received donations from Well Wishes. The Office of the Mayor of Walfish Bay, in collaboration with Miss Namibia and the, Namib uh, and the Namibian Red Cross, donated parcels containing sanitary pads, toiletries, nappies, maize meal flour, etc., to three families who were left in displaced after the fire ripped through their shacks in Crescent Moon. So guys, so dear viewers, this is quite an interesting publication of this week. So make sure to grab yourself a copy.